2.5 kilos. Nicely done. Really nice and speedy there. Danger. That's right. 162.5 kilos in the bar now for Labella. Another 10 kilo jump. Again, it's not the craziest to see an opener and then jump to the second. The opener sometimes, especially when you've done international travel, it's more of a, a tester, a feeler to see where you're at. <laughs> and it didn't slow her down too exactly. much. Exactly, yeah. And then based off that bar for Labella. Also, give a shout out to these spotters. They work hard and they have caught so many failed attempts. Just in a day, the amount of catches they make. Wow. Nice. And that is a Whenever I t hear lifters say I had a bad day, I mean, I went three for nine or whatever I'm like look that's a way better day than bombing out there is worse there's nothing worse than bombing out it's a it is a terrible feeling you don't have much to tell the lifter after that <laughs> usually hopefully it's a lesson they you know only need to learn once though nice and smooth opener A lot of times to help popularize the powerlifting in that, a particular nation, you just need one open world champion to lead the charge. That is a smooth bench. Yeah, really lovely there. So that we've had a couple good fights here. Yeah, really great effort. First attempts of the next flight of lifters, and we have La Bella of Argentina opening on 150 kilos. So we're back to the openers. We have 10 lifters in this flight. If I, yeah, 11. With 160 kilos, she's jumped 10 from her opener. Very strong there. And Final polls. These ladies are trying to improve their standings, possibly reach national records and personal bests. La Bella now of Argentina with 162.5 kilos. She's jumped two and a half from her second. Be a small personal best. But a personal best nonetheless. Oh, look at the heart on this lady. What Beautiful a fight. Unfortunately, I think she got called on hit.